Hey, it's Todd with InGear Garage with a quick tech tip for you on how to get your gauges to work properly when you do an LS swap. Now we had upgraded our Suburban when it had just a small block. We put in a really nice classic instruments dash, but here we are putting in our LS and wondering what we do for coolant temperature and oil pressure sensor. The nice thing is that Classic has a couple different solutions for you that are really easy. Starting with your coolant temperature sensor. They offer what they call an SN 12 millimeter temperature sensor. And on the LS engines, there's a temperature sensor on the front of the driver's bank on the cylinder head. And that one you can retain and use for the ECU. And then in the back of the passenger head, there's a port that you just take out a little Allen head and you screw this one back in. And there's your temperature. Now one tech tip for you on this is that they do want you to use a little bit of sealant on here. So they provide a brass washer that provides a really good ground for the sensor so you don't have to worry about it. All right, so now that you got your temperature sensor figured out, now it's time to move on to the oil pressure. And here you got a couple of different ways to go. If you're handy with a drill and a tap, then you can just simply drill an eighth inch hole down into the oil bypass cover and tap it for NPT one eighth inch NPT threads. And then you can screw the electric sensor right into that and have it. Or on the back of the engine, if you find a 16 by 1.5 millimeter that go, adapter that goes to eighth inch NPT threads and they're out there. You can put that into the back just like a small block Chevy, the oil pressure is still back here and get the adapter in there. So that's all you got to do to get your temperature and your oil pressure dialed in for your gauges inside your car when you're doing your LS swap. If you got any questions, dial up classicinstruments.com, give them a call, shoot them an email and they'll take care of you. Thanks for watching.